one of the most important things about playing music is whatever instrument you're playing is that you play in tune. Uh, now, in wind instruments, most of them you can you can like lip it up if you're flat, and relax a little if you're sharp. But can't do that with an open string on a, a stringed instrument. So you need to learn how to tune your instrument. I'll help you if you need help, but you must learn how to tune your instrument. First thing, you need to know the notes of your open strings. You've got to know. Should be in the book. If not, you know what they say. Google it. Then you need to have a tuner. Now there's a clip-on kind. It seems to be real popular. Put them up on the headstock. They work pretty good. I've got one on my phone that I think is a great tuner. Uh, the app is um, named Ultimate Tuner. It's an app. I think it works on Android and Apple products. Ultimate Tuner. But I've also, I'm going to put up here in the picture in just a minute, both of these uh, tuners that are free online. The first one is guitar-tuner.app. The second is guitar dash tuner dot org so I'll put those up and probably run them uh, during the time of, of this uh, video next I'm gonna move over and tell you about a metronome a metronome keeps the beat for you so when you're practicing even doing a four finger warm up you've got something that's that you've set Da, 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 like that. So uh, they make a metronome, uh, and I don't have one on my phone anymore, but I used to have a good metronome that did drum beats, but probably for practice, if you're a beginner or a early on in playing, you don't really need the drum beat every time. You, you need just the tick, 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 tick. Now, the best type of metronome is going to be visual and audio so you can see the the beat and you can hear the beat a lot of them will have a different color for one two three four one two three four so I have uh, two that uh, will work for you the first one is online dash metronome Dot org and I'll put that up the second one they misspell metronome but that's okay it's the way they got their uh, their website and there you can go there it is simply m e t r o n o m dot u s metronome without the e dot u s and I'll put both of these up there for you now let me tell you a little bit more with the courses that have the Hal Leonard proprietary player it's not going to be a metronome, but you will hear and it starts. So that's what I'm talking about. So when you're practicing with, with the book for the lesson, uh, you won't necessarily need another metronome, but I'm giving you this, you know, these free sites because you need a metronome, especially as we move forward, strum patterns, scales, modes, licks, runs. You need a metronome. We all do. Uh, and what will happen is in time, that metronome, the counting, the feeling of the beat without having to do so much to be sure you're on the beat, it'll just be inside you. Now, let's be clear about this. There is no hero inside you, okay? Our hero is Jesus Christ. And when he comes inside through the presence of the Holy Spirit, that's something very, very special. But what we want is not only Jesus inside of us, we want to feel the beat inside of us. So I'm wishing you the best. I'll do my best to teach you metronome.